Hello friends, welcome once again. Uh, today we are having Mr. Akshay who has scored All India Rank 1 in SRF Fruit Science 2022. So Akshay please, now you can share your strategy. Uh, Thank you sir. Hello everyone, I am Akshay Hilo. I am from Hisar, Haryana. I have completed my UG from CCHU Hisar, Haryana and okay. I have pursued my MSc from ICR IRI in New Delhi and now I have secured AIR1 in SRF Fruit Sciences. Okay, that's great news Akshay. Congratulations. Thank you sir. So today Akshay will share the strategy how to crack SRF Fruit Science for coming examination. So actually, as we know that uh, like the syllabus of ICR SRF is divided into different parts. Yes. So can we go through the different parts? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, the SRF fruit science is consists of actually three parts: part A, part B, and part C. Okay. Part A it consists of general agriculture, general knowledge, and about raising ability. Okay. And part B, sir, it consists of the core group, which mm -hmm. consists of five subjects. And the first is fruit science, then vegetable science, then floriculture then post harvest technology and then uh, spices, condiments and aromatics okay then the next the part c which is the main part it consists of the specialized subject like for us it is fruit science okay great. Uh, part a it consists of 20 questions part b it consists of 50 questions and part c itself it consists of 50 questions can we go through the uh, different part wise like we can go for the part a which consists of 20 questions of gs or general ability yes. Like we know, uh, part A it consists of 20 questions okay. and it mostly consists of like current affairs, like some basic agriculture questions and okay. schemes and at all. Yeah. So for uh, current affairs, you can go for reading newspapers, okay. like for the past 5 to 6 months before the exam, okay. you must okay. go for reading newspapers. Mm -hmm. Then after that, for general agriculture, you can go for Nebra Sula. And a little little a small small knowledge of every subject should be there. Like this year the major questions came from economics and okay. from economics subject specific and last year it came from horticulture. Okay. So we cannot predict that uh, the next year which subject they may give. So you must have a uh, small or little knowledge of every subject. Now coming to part B, that is horticulture as a core group. Yes. So there are also 50 questions will be there. Yes. Okay, so what is the question pattern over there? Like for the part B, as we know that they it will consist of 50 questions. Okay. But usually it doesn't contain the statements, questions or reason and assertion questions. Okay, okay. there is no any kind of uh, reason, okay. reason or assertion uh, kind of question. the past two, three year papers, there is no such question. Okay. So okay. you can just go for basic knowledge of every subject, okay. all the five subjects in the core group. Okay. And like uh, for fruits, you can go for the major crops and whatever the specific questions uh, according to the each group, you can mainly focus on that. Okay. So here like no need to go in depth? No need, uh, there is no need to go in depth for the, these 50 questions. Okay. Usually these are up to the GRF level only. Okay. But it will not contain the in depth questions. Okay. So for this part, uh, which book they have to follow like as you say that it comprises of five different subjects? Yes. Sir. Like for the objective type books, you can go for instant horticulture or okay. glossed, either for glossed horticulture or for essence. Like if you have read glossed for GRF, go for glossed horticulture. If you have read essence, then go for essence of horticulture. Okay. Then so after that, uh, like of course, and specific, uh, you can read uh, handbook of horticulture. Mm -hmm. Then after that, glossed horticulture, this is enough. And then for vegetable, you can also go for handbook of horticulture and glossed and instant. Like for okay. Singapore floriculture, you can go for Desras, objective book is there, introduction yes. to floriculture. Okay. Then after that, um, post harvest technology, you can go for uh, fruit and vegetable processing, that is by Srivastava. Okay. And uh, for um, spices and condiments, you can go for uh, the introduction to the spices, uh, spices, uh, medicine and aromatic plants, that is by M. Kumar. Okay, thoroughly we have to read the things. Only. Yes. Now coming to the third part, that is part C which is the specialized subject fruit science here we have uh, to talk nicely so Akshay please share your strategy for this yes sir uh, like the, for the part C that is the specialized subject group like for us it is uh, fruit science okay. like as we all know it also consists of 50 questions but uh, in this there will be in-depth questions from the every crop like okay. for to attend this part you must have the in-depth knowledge of every crop and questions will, uh, questions will be both like this year the most of the questions were 
statements, reasons, assertions okay. like that. As in part C, uh, syllabus is uh, given differently. It's a very vast subject as we know that in the case of homology different uh, uh, topic wise content is there. So what will, you, what will be your suggestion like uh, which book we, we have to follow and we have to memorize like that in a sequence? So, like uh, in part C as we know it consists of 50 questions mm -hmm. but in this part uh, the questions will be in depth and mm -hmm. it will not be as simple as in part B. Okay. Uh, so for that you must have the uh, in-depth knowledge of every row. Mm -hmm. Like uh, this year most of the questions came like statement wise and all. So okay. for that you must have the in-depth knowledge of the row. Of the row. Yes. Okay. Like for basic knowledge you can go for uh, handbook of horticulture both volume 1 and volume 2. Okay. And then for like uh, breeding all the fruit loops you can go for the PKD which is also a good book. And for the like current uh, varieties and current affairs uh, related to horticulture, you can go for the horticulture update. Okay. So, um, if uh, some recent question is there related to biotech and breeding, so it's uh, better to read some review papers, what will be your suggestion? Yes, sir, it will be good, like uh, every year I think one to two questions will come from the, either from biotechnology or biofortification, like okay. that, for that you can go for review papers, for articles. Okay. The recent articles like 2021, 2022, like because these will contain all the information till next year. Okay, so it's a very great point as Akshay shared that like for the recent information we must read some research paper. Uh, they may sometime ask only few questions will be there, but they may decide your right. Yes. So anything else you wanted to say, Mr. Akshay? Like um, suppose uh, in some part question is hard. Yes. Sir. Suppose that as you said that in part 1, in section 1, uh, most of the questions was from the economics. Yes. So we have to attempt those questions or we just uh, have to leave the questions? In exams uh, you must have the risk for 10 to 15 questions. Sir. Okay, we, we have, have to take risk at least 10 to 15 questions. 10 to 15 questions, you have to take risk sir, mm -hmm. because uh, those questions will be ranked beside you. Okay. okay. So you must... Uh, I take this for 10 Okay, so if your attempt is fine, your attempt is good, you can take some risk also as I is saying that. Yes. So that can be depend. So that risk we can take, we have to take on the questions which is having 50-50 ratio or directly we have to First you go for that questions which you have 50-50 ratio sir. Uh, I will suggest only 50-50 questions you must okay. go and but if you like you are drafting question paper and you have it very less okay. then you have to go for other questions also or otherwise there will be uh, no option. Okay. So thank you Akshay. I think now we are having a holistic approach how Akshay secured all India rank 1 in SRF Fruit Science 2022. Okay Akshay, all the best and well wishes from my side. Thank you sir. Thank you very much. Thank you.